Evening, folks. Oh, Tom looks gone crazy. It was Tom, it was. Okay, anyways, just before Tom carries on for a little bit, evening folks, this is uh, Vagrant, we are back playing Animal Crossing's New Horizons. We're here on uh, Twin Peaks, and Tom is giving us our morning announcement. The Twin Peaks airport has opened up, very cool. We can fly to other islands for a visit. I think you guys at home can actually come and visit my island. I've got postal services if you want to send me things. <laughs> I put myself in 24 hours a day, drop by for a look. That's all for me. I hope you all enjoy another fine day of luxurious twin. Mate, I live in a tent. <laughs> what are you on about, Tommy boy? What are you on about? I have to do something. This is very unprofessional, but bear with me. Babes, can you... What time's it now? Um, 20 past 6. Can you give me a shower at about 10 soon? Yeah. Right. Sorry. <laughs> My phone is ringing. <laughs> Hi, Tom. How you doing, buddy? Sorry for the sun focal. Hmm? Okay. Not actually used the mobile phone. Oh, 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 I'm vibrating. Have fun. <laughs> Call resident. Why do I need an app to make a phone call? Modern technology is crazy. Okay. Is that how I play with other players? I guess so. Now, here we are. This is our first uh, brand new day right here on the island. Now, there's something I want to show you very quickly. Something I think fairly typical to Animal Crossing, but for me, actually quite new. If we head over here to the left, Naruto running my way, this tent right here? I think it's this one. Yeah, Is it this one? No, it's this one up here. It's this one up here. Um, so, apparently Animal Crossing, this version, works a little bit differently to past versions. Basically, the island, as in Twin Peaks, is kind of locked not to my save file, but in, or to my game cartridge, but to my Nintendo Switch itself. You used to be able to swap save files in the past and even swap game cartridges. Cartridges is what I think you had to do to swap islands, but it's all linked now to my Switch. So this is actually my girlfriend's little tent and her build. She was playing on the game. She's played it for a couple hours this morning whilst I was watching the film and stuff. So she's now on the island with me essentially. So it's kind of cool in a way that you share the island but I was also getting really paranoid that uh, like things would develop and new things would be built and stuff like that. You can see not much has really changed which is good. But it made me a little paranoid and apparently this is something we can't change. We have to live with it. He's still got his flag! <laughs> Hello Timmy. Tommy even. I actually don't know what to do, pal. I haven't heard about the DIY workshop. <laughs> the voice is incredible. I'm gonna... No, but we've got some mail. Let's check out the mail. First priority. Let's have a little look. I've got two from Nintendo. Right, Nintendo, what do you want? Congratulations on your big move. They're gonna give me a gift. What's my gift? Okay. And uh, something else. Thanks for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a gift. Feel free. <laughs> Jeez, Nintendo. And Mom. My dear Rudiger. Mom, you called me Rudiger. Like, how dear could I be? How is your new life treating you? Are you eating well, brushing your teeth, washing behind your ears? Oh dear, I'm all worked up. Here's a little something to help out. Eat it or plant it, but think of me. I'm going to think of you as I eat like a fruit mother. <laughs> that would be very strange. Okay, what has she given me? Let's have a little look at our inventory. Where we to pop these open? Simple DIY workbench. Nintendo Switch. Cool, put that down in the house. Tent. And some pears. Awesome. Right, can I put down this workbench? Is that a thing? Oh no, it's a recipe. Okay. Huh. I'm gonna nip inside. Gonna put the Switch down. You know, gonna be coming home late at night, hard day planting pears, as I want to do. I need to uh, have something to do. Oh. I really don't like this placement. It's the only complaint I have so far. I don't like the placement system. Yeah? 
There we go, beautiful. <laughs> right, I'm feeling good. Let's go check in with Tom and uh, the main residence area. And we want to make sure, we, we want to make friends with the locals as well. We also want to pick everything, I think. I'm just going to grab everything, basically, as we run along. Another thing I was paranoid about. <laughs> she was playing it, I was like, hey, just make sure you don't take everything on the island, please. I don't think it's a real concern, but I don't know. I haven't really played Animal Crossing before. This is all very new to me. And I was reading some reviews and stuff, people who, like, share with their kids, and their kids delete their entire town. <laughs> hey, buddy. What's your name? Buck. Buck, let's talk. Yo, I'm pumped about that spot you helped paint me for my tent. Thanks for the push. I hope we can keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies, partner. If you keep saying partner, Buck, we're not going to be friends. Oh, he's going to be a present, though. <gasps> Buck. Amazing. I do want to put it on Buck. I do. Oh, Buck, I take back everything I said we can be best friends. I look like a baller. A terrifying, terrifying baller. Hello, cutie. All right, what's this? There you go. <laughs> so we can, we can post to the bulletin board, which is pretty cool. And let's hop over here. I've not been in here. Remember, this was shut last night when we uh, tried to enter. Just like my ex-girlfriend. <laughs> so sorry. Uh, right, ah, we're gonna go. Welcome, welcome. As you can see, it is quite cosy. It is. Okay, cool. <laughs> Come on, Tom, you've got to get your kid into capitalism nice and early. Offering free dareway workshop. Nice. I think it would be quite useful. I do hope you take me up on it. I will do, Tom. I will do. Right, what have we got here? We've got like an ATM machine, seemingly. Oh, how could I forget? Hmm. Previous terminal. Nook stop. Okay. Okay, we can buy some stuff for the house, maybe. And we've got a bank of nuke. Hi, right, cheers, Tom. Ooh, they want 50 bonus. Okay, we're going to have to come on every single bloody day. <laughs> it was just kind of the idea behind Animal Crossing, I guess. You just check in for a little bit every day, you know? Let's have a little look. Okay, yeah. Air conditioners, benches, bandanas, shades. Love it. Yeah, just some random ass stuff, basically. <laughs> and what's the ABD? Okay. Well, I have no money to speak of. Do I get interest? Can I, like, launder money? <laughs> Is that a thing? <laughs> okay. Well, I'm going to talk to. I'm going to talk. I'm going to check what this is. Explain it to me, Tom. Recycle box for all the island residents. Okay. That's sweet. Cheers, Tommy. I will take nothing. Okay. Tim, talk to me. Tom, Timmy, yes. Timmy doesn't have a flag, I've got to remember that. He must be very disappointed. Okay. What are you selling to me, Timmy? Tin buckets and director's chairs. Okay. Cool. Oh, so many people to talk to. Tom? Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. What do you want me to do? What is my... Yeah, what's my goal? I haven't, Tom. Teach me how to workshop, my friend. He's so cute. He's not Tom. Tom. Okay. We're gonna make some tools. Keep our recipes. Yes. What a coincidence. He's a chonky lad, isn't he? 
Yep, sounds good. Five tree branches. It's a little flimsy, that's okay. Okay, cool. We've got a plan, we've got something to do, that's all I wanted. A goal in mind, or some description. Let's go find some wood. Look at this little flag! <laughs> I love it, it's my favourite thing. Oh no, wait, we're not going to do... I want to say Spanish. Eyes, zwei. Where's my dry? Where's my dry? Has somebody been picking up all the branches on my island? <laughs> okay, legit, there's no branches left. You've got to shake the trees. Hmm? You've got to shake the trees. For branches? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey! Release your secrets! Tree fiend. It honestly, it looks like a weird upside down penis. Alright, one, two, uh, give you a little wiggle. Stroke the tree. Get some wood. <laughs> oh god. Come on, family friendly, family friendly. There we go. This better be a bloody amazing fishing rod. Where's the thingy at? Where's my girl at? I don't see you on the map. I hear someone knocking about though. That was little Tommy with his little flag. It's like a TARDIS in here, isn't it? Okay, I'm on it. Car on it. Craftable flimsy fishing rod. Cool. Yeah, I even had a spare tree branch. I'm that skilled. Let's do it. Oh my god, calm down, lad. Oh, he's an eager beaver, isn't he? I made a flint. Looks like a toolbox to me. But... Okay. Tom, I don't have a blimmin' clue how. There you go. The game's gonna hook me up. There we go. We've got a DIY, DIY, DIY recipe. Recipe. <laughs> Splendid. Thank you, DIY Rob Snow. So ready to use at any time. Cool. Aim in front of the shadow of a fish. In front of the shadow of a fish when you cast your line. Okay. That's why I'm clicking a game. Hey, Numpy. There we go. Right, we can make a campfire and we can make a net. So what do we need? We need five tree branches and three tree branches. We need eight tree branches. That's quick maths. And we've got one. How many do we need then? Seven! That's very quick maths. Uh, how do I open my phone? Oh, well, that's why I do that. No. Aha! Camera, miles, recipes. Okay, cool. Okay, I think maybe I can now use that recipe I had. This one. Sweet! Yeah. I'm gonna make my own little bench. Alright, let's do some shaking. And then we'll go get some fish. Take bloody ages. I need a. You know what I need? Like an axe or something. Or a chainsaw. Chainsaw would be better. Can I hold it? No, I have to tap it like a madman. <laughs> okay, I'm just tapped. Oh, it's a three. We need what? Oh, we needed a few. This button. That one. There we go. How much do we need for the actual workbench? Oh, we need hardwood and iron nuggets. Okay, that's that seems like a while away. 
Just focus on getting this stuff and then we'll go get some um, fish. And we are good. It looks like they cap out at two. No, stop picking up the trash, child. It's kind of disconcerting. I've been kind of like swept away to this uh, deserted island to live on my own and essentially be in charge of this community and start the whole thing. And yet I look like a 12 year old. <laughs> it's a weird combination. There we go. Get some peaches on. I don't see any fish. Hello, kitty. Oh, 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 didn't know I could. I was a little terrified there. There you go, hello, buddy. Pashmina. You're gonna give me a present. Pashmina, put some pants on. <laughs> I was thinking about how to thank you. I think you came up with it, Pashmina. Jesus. A lot of weeds. All right. So I read as a little starter tip. I think I have to actually learn the recipe, don't I? Yeah. That so you can sell the weeds, right? But I believe you can turn fifteen weeds into the umbrella, and you'll actually earn twice as much for the same thing. Am I crazy? Did the game teach me how to fish? Well, I'm, I'm gonna learn anyway, I guess. That's a fish, right? <laughs> Alright. Oh, he's thinking about it. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Maybe that's better. Oh, oh, he spotted it. Alright, the game didn't actually teach me how to fish, I just kind of figured it out, but we got there. It's a horse mackerel. Mackerel. Okay. Cool. Looks like a little pier. I think this is the, uh, the airline, but... Oh, I can't get down there. Right, I'm gonna catch some more. Let's have a little look. See if we can spot any other fish nugget. Ah, ah, cheeky, cheeky. That uh, looks like a big one as well. Who's hungry? Come on, come on. Oh. Can I hold it? No. Why is the uh, ground randomly spursing water, by the way? I haven't quite figured that out yet. <laughs> oh, come on, you're a chunk. I'm going to try again. There we go, there we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go. Ah! Yeah, oh, look at that. It's a place. It's a flounder. Same thing, basically. And oh, no, no, can't stop, won't stop. <laughs> I got a ball. What's that? Someone out there somewhere. I just might have come up with a DIY recipe. Recipe that'll change everything. My great idea is in this bottle here. Take a chance on it, you'll see. Take a chance to try it out, and I get to work aviary. Avery, iron wood table. Cool. Cheers, random bottle man. Right, I'm gonna get one more fish. Ooh, a bit of coral. Ooh, what's it? I just want everything. What's this? It's a shell. Oh, oh it's a hermit crab. I'm not allowed to steal him away, apparently. Yeah, looking good, looking good. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go. It's a coral fish. All right, that's 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 a pretty good hole right there. I'm gonna put this away. I need a little bit more wood as well. Oh, I got a coin. 
Well, right, I would have done a coin, but what are you going to do? The bells, aren't they? It's, it's, it's the first money I've got in all bloody games so far, so... Let me get some weeds. I'm not sure if I'm meant to be leaving any of these or something, so they grow back later on so we can make more money, but... I'm just kind of going to do what I want, <laughs> basically. Alright, looking good. How are we on? Face it. Oh, they right. Oh. I have a feeling I'm meant to leave those ones. Because they look like developed, that maybe they'll spread around more to the area, if that makes sense. They'll release their sweet, sweet pollen to the world. Or something. We're going to do some crafting. We want a... a net. <laughs> On an absolute ranger. Keep crafting. And um, we want a campfire. And we're going to make some umbrellas as well. Let's nice see if I can make two. One more, and we are looking toasty. Oh, does it also say... Ah, yeah, it takes everything you've already crafted before. That's actually pretty handy. You know, I think people who see me play other games will know I'm a little bit of a completionist. So, I like being able to monitor what I've done, you know? I've got an audience, which is nice. Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me? I found you some fish, son. Look at my flounder. Don't take it, though. I want it. Maybe even a squid? An old friend of mine runs a museum. Yes, that's what I want to hear. No. Oh, no, don't take my fl Oh, Go on, then. Mm. <laughs> I'm sure it's not. He just shoved this fish in his back pocket. He's a mad lad. Critopedia, cool. Bugs and fish we can catch. Sweet. It's a collector's nightmare. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, cheers, Tommy. Let's have a little look at that, shall we? Uh when I remember how to do absolutely anything. There we go. Critterpedia. So, check this out for information on the bugs and fish you've caught. Well, we haven't got any bugs. These are all our fish. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, what? Confused. But I have caught fish. Do I have to do something with them? <laughs> it's not what I was going for, but okay. I have, Tom. I have. You did, Tom. You cheered me on. Oh, sweet. Okay, well, this is this is a good reason to hook Tom up with some fish. He's going to hook me, with, hook me up with some uh, recipes in return. Ah, nice. That's what I want. They are indeed, Tommy. They are indeed. 
Alright. I'm not sure how I feel about this, Tom. I'm gonna give you my squid, okay? I feel upset about this already, but here you go. Hmm. You better hook me up for this one, Nucky. There we go. He's a good egg, isn't he? He's a good egg. Looks like fertilizer. Oh, red tulip bag. Okay. Alright, cool. Well, I guess he wants me to keep going with that. Alright, Tom. I'll bring you everything I get. Upsets me to my core, but it's alright. Okay, well I wanna I wanna do some planning. Um Alright, cool. It's a really annoying number. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, what have I done? Nope. Just can you just put them where I believe want you to put them please? Game <laughs> What is this? <laughs> I think I'm not allowed to put it on that little bit, you know. Oh, that's a disaster, isn't it? That's a god darn mess. What do I need for... I need to the umbrellas. What do I need for this, um... For the axe? Oh my god, hello. Gonna be cheeky here. Tiki torch! Okay, I need wood, right? We obviously need to make the axe. Oh, I want a birdhouse. I want steaks. Oh, I want everything. Where's the axe? There it is. We need stone. Okay, well, we're not, we're not quite done deco, are we? Wait, didn't I make... How was that? There we go, beautiful. Okay. Um... What did I just... Ah, hello! Okay. Wait, 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 wait. No, stop that. I need my net. Come here, you. Yeah. It's beautiful! A tiger butterfly. I've earned my strength. Am I going to get a little pun for every single one? Because I'm totally on board with that. <laughs> Alright, where am I going to get stone from? Other than... Oh, okay, okay. Yep, figured it out. Ah, oh, oh, what are you? Come here. Come hither. I think it's another tiger, isn't it? Wah. Hey, you cheeky little blighter. Oi! <laughs> You will live with me now. You don't get a say in the matter. Yeah, another tiger. Someone over there as well. No butterfly will be safe from my wrath. Timmy, get out the way. Shouldn't all butterflies be yelled? They should be, Rudiger. They should be. That's a big old fish right there. I'm going to go left. Am I too far away from that? Oh no, we're looking good, we're looking good. What is that cheeky little thing? Hopefully it's something I've already given him, and that way I can keep it for myself. <laughs> wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, go! Oh, it's new. It is a dace. Hope I have some space. So what do we do with the rock? Probably not that. Oi. Put it away. How do I get a rock? Hmm. Hmm. I actually don't know. Maybe I can buy one from him. I thought I'd maybe... What was this? I don't know. I thought I'd maybe just find them like... Oh, oh, maybe this one, maybe this one. Yeah, there we go. Right, I actually think I've got enough materials to do this. Gizmo, Gizmo. I'm <laughs> still just trying to remember the controls. Uh, yeah, sweet, perfect. Okay, we can go make ourselves an axe and give away my beautiful stuff. Oh, oh, you're new, you're new, you're new. It's a, I swear that's a butterfly. I swear. The colour scheme is perfectly a butterfly. although there's a good chance butterfly was based on a real butterfly, and that's what it is. What is that beautiful little critter? It is a common butterfly. They often flutter 
Oh, I think I just died inside a little bit. <laughs> and I love it. I'm totally on board with it. If this is how I'm going to die, then I'm totally okay with that. This is this is the way to go, really. Alright, Tom. I've got many insects for you to put into your back pocket. Alright, well, let's talk about these moving fees. 5,000 miles. Well, I've got 50. <laughs> I mean, we're near enough there, if we're honest. Alright, well, take all my creatures from me. Reward me for my plundering of the natural environment. It is a dace, Tom. I would not mind at all. I'm assuming the museum is kind of like, kind of like in Portia, right? Where you store all the items that you craft and stuff like that. And that when this museum arrives, I'll either get everything back or they'll kind of auto-populate the museum. The flowers that grow will be very strong, they'll spring up even if you just plant them and forget them. But if you water them each day, that's where the magic happens. Watering opens up the possibility of propagating and crossbreeding your flowers to develop rare colours. Very cool. You're going to help me up for a watering can. Or well, the recipe for a watering can. He is indeed. <laughs> Alright Tom, we're going to be talking a lot about this, I'm afraid, pal. So, three butterflies to give away as well. And then, maybe there's a few more fish? I don't know for sure. It is a common butterfly. I wouldn't... Tom? <laughs> I've not minded the other ten times. Okay. <laughs> How long does this reward system go on for? I was talking to Blavers. Ah, the museum dude, right? It's come to fruition. Cool. Currently stationed on an island, we decided to call Twin Peaks. The local fauna is abundant as expected. Lovely. Five outstanding specimens. Tom's loving it. <laughs> so sorry to keep you. It's alright, Tom. Very cool. Since you've done so much scouting and collecting already, would you be able to help? Ah, okay. All right, okay. I'm gonna gonna choose where the museum goes. Awesome. We're not done yet, Tommy boy. We might actually be done. That might actually be... Maybe I needed the five. Yeah, it looks like I did. Okay. So what do we do next? Well, after we put the museum down. Hmm? Okay. Ah. I knew that, Tommy. I knew that. Right. Well, we're going to put the museum down and that's where we'll uh, call it a day. Where are we gonna... Nice open space. Again, I don't want to block the sight view of my beautiful horror film house, so... I mean, it probably makes sense to go around the middle, right? Uh, can I stick it on top of the kid's head? Oh, it's only used ten. Okay, well, he can go here. Oh, well, it's a unit. Um, okay. Put it behind the plaza, maybe. Yeah. Okay. Let's. Well, let's 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 see what it's gonna look like. That's cool. Um. Yeah. <clears throat> I think we can move the stuff later on as well. There we go. Look at that. Beautiful. Lavis is going to come and uh, hook us up. Right. Alright, well, we've uh, gathered many new creatures. We still have a few left, but I guess we can save those for the museum or go put them down in the house for a little bit. Uh, need to go craft our axe, cut down some trees or at least attack some trees, hopefully get some slightly better materials, craft, do some more crafting, hopefully upgrade our tent to a house at some point, and then we'll see what else the future holds. Until the next time, then. Thank you very much for joining me. Ladies and gentlemen, I shall see you lovely folks in the next episode. Cheers, much love, as always. Bye-bye.